Christianity a religion in your own understanding? Is Christianity a religion? Mm-hmm. Mm. Christianity is not a religion. Okay. The moment you see something as a religion, it controls. Listen carefully. The moment you see something as religion, it controls you. What is religion? Religion is um I can create my own religion now. Let me make it practical. Okay. I can call this thing mm-hmm. the God of a corner bar. Okay. You understand? And then this God of a corner bar, I know what I put the sacrifices on this God of a corner bar. And it works for me. You understand? Mm. So if I want to do service, that's why I can boldly say Wednesday is deliverance service. Because mm. if I'm working the God of Israel, the mm. God of Jacob, the God of Isaac, Jesus is using me. Mm. I will never choose one day to say it's a, a Wednesday is a deliverance service. Because mm. that God does not choose a day to, to do miracles. He works every day. Oh. So because I am using this God, I can easily tell you I'm going to do miracle service on Wednesdays. Okay. I thought maybe the, the, those things, they, they happen between Saturday and Sunday. Or it, 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 it goes with what God, the religion God chooses. does not do miracle with days or time. Okay. Miracle happens anytime. Okay. So once I've chosen a day, Okay. This is my God. Mm. And I know the rules of my God. That's a religion. That's a religion. So because of that, I can use this. Yes. Let's say you want baby. Mm. I will talk to this God. Mm. Come to you. You come to the church. Mm. I will see you. I'll mention your name. Ah, I can see you are looking for a child. Come, mm. my child. Come. Mm. Place your hand on your forehead. Mm. You understand? And you place your hand on your forehead. Yes, yes, yes. yes. And then I start mentioning this. Yeah. They say this is cap. Mm. Okay? This mm. is cap. Mm. Cap a corner bar. So I say cap a corner bar, cap a corner bar, cap a corner bar, cap a corner bar, cap a corner bar. You understand? Mm-hmm. You know I'm speaking in tongues. Yeah. But I'm calling my God. Yeah, yeah. You follow what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I'm with you. I'm calling my God. I'm with you. So I'll be saying cap a corner bar, cap a corner bar, cap a corner bar, cap a corner bar, cap a corner bar. You understand? Yeah, yeah. And you think I'm speaking tongues. I'm calling my God. Yeah, yeah. And then when it comes, I will know that God is there. Okay. Because the of God that. God that you... You worship. I worship. Okay. You understand? Yeah. And then I will use Jesus' name. Fall down. Jesus is not the name. So you can use Jesus to even call the God of a corner. But it will work. Jesus is not the name. So you mean that it's allowed to call Jesus' name in anything? Even even if, Balawus or uh, Sangumes can use Jesus in their... Yeah. No, even not that. Maybe in extreme, maybe when I'm making love, can I say Jesus? They, they, they keep saying it, you understand? If Christians respect the name Jesus Christ, they will not be using the name Jesus Christ in sex making. Okay. You understand? There's hmm. no way a Muslim will be having sex and will be saying, Allah. ah, Muhammad, Muhammad. Muhammad. Yes. <laughs> okay. There's no way a Jewish... Will be having sex and will be saying um, 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 Elohim, Elohim. Mm-hmm. But we use Jesus in everything. That is not the name. Oh. That is not his name. That is why in Israel they said if you want to mention the name of Jesus Christ, mention his real name. What is his real name? Christians should go find out. You said you want to worship. You must know what you are worshiping. I'm not a Christian. So they will add it in the comment section oh, down They below. will help me to Some, understand. Somebody will write, somebody will write. Jeshua Hamashiach, somebody will write Messiah. I know they will write those things. That's not the name. Okay. So we I are know the name. To call. You we understand? So because of it. this, can I can deliver you in the name of Jesus. But okay. I am using God of a cornerbar to deliver you. Mm. And because I am using God of a cornerbar to deliver you, in your mind, you think I'm using Jesus Christ or I'm a mm. Christian. In your mind, mm. you think I'm a Christian because I use Jesus to deliver you. Mm. But I know what I called to deliver you. Yeah, yeah. And because of that, okay, mm. you have become part of my religion I have created. You will now start calling people for me. Hey, this guy is very good. He's powerful. <laughs> okay. You will come. I'm a reference now. You will come with another uh, group. Yes. When they come, I will then tell them, you understand, in my church, mm-hmm. if you want to Come to my altar. You need to pray to this thing. They will go and do it. Mm. 
if you want to come to my church, if you want to do this to my church, you need to dress a certain way. They would dress that way. Mm. If you want to come to my church, ladies need to sit this side. Guys have to sit this side. You need to dress this this way. Mm. We need to do... Mm. That is religion. You, uh, you're creating your own... It's more like it's a culture in, in a nutshell. We can that is religion. A Kwanaba's religion. You understand? And so now, me. those people under me, they will start praying through me. The God of Kwanaba, please bless me. The God of Kwanaba, please bless me. And then we still think that we're talking to... Do you know the God of Kwanaba? So you are praying to the God of Kwanaba to bless you. You think because I delivered somebody with the name of Jesus. Mm. I am a Christian. I am using this. So the God of Akonaba bless me. You will be blessed because you are under me. Mm. And I've played my four hands upon your forehead. You understand? With, I've the, played power me. Of, oh, with the power of Akonaba. So I have access to all of you guys out there. Because of that, I've created my religion. But it does, I can even that? stand on my pulpit and made a command that Tuesday we are going on demonstration. The market has to be closed. They will follow me. Tell me that sounds like dark space. I don't want to lie. You but understand? It's still called religion. On December, we are going to vote. God has revealed to me, vote for Ekonaba. They will vote for Ekonaba. <laughs> Under what grounds? It doesn't matter. But because of Ekonaba. It's, it's a religion. Yeah, yeah. You so understand? Re- religion is not Christianity. Christianity is not a religion. It's a lifestyle. That's why they, when they go to Antioch, they call them Christians because they call the man Christ. Mm. You understand? Mm. Savior. So when they see the lifestyle of those guys at Antioch, then they say, ah, these guys, they pay, their lifestyle, they be that of Christ. Mm. So they call them Christians. It's a lifestyle. It's not a religion. Once it becomes a religion, it controls you. Mm. You only do what I say. And then when you're a Christian, you are not, aren't you controlled by the word of God they say, the word of God in the Bible? The, Isn't that being controlled as well, even if you're a Christian? Can you give me an example of word of God that has controlled somebody? Um, ten commandments. That's a no kid. Is, is that a sin? Yes, yeah, the, no, 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 other thing, Ten Commandments isn't something that we have directed on how to, to lead. If everybody can follow Ten Commandments, the world will be peaceful. That's what I'm saying, isn't part of Christ, being a Christian when you... you fo- and the Ten Commandments is not for you, even for Christians. But what I'm saying is, you said, when you follow religion, it means that you are being controlled. That's what I'm saying, the Ten Commandments is not for Christians. It's, Moses is not a Christian. Then Ten Commandments is for who then? Moses got the Ten Commandments for the Israelis. Oh, when not went, for Africans, not for no, us. No, 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 not for Africans. But oh. the Ten Commandments, if you follow it, it will help you. Oh. You understand? There are a lot of things in the Bible, when you follow, it will help you. But it doesn't it's mean it's the it's word of God. Us. You understand? It doesn't mean it's the word of God, and doesn't mean it's for you. Oh. You understand? There are a lot of things in the Bible, you follow it will help you. You understand? Mm-hmm. So let's not go about the Bible then. Let's concentrate on how making religion a Christian life to control the minds of the people. Okay. Because there are a lot of vulnerable people out there who are being controlled by this word religion. Because Mina, I'm, I'm, I've always been confused. I always thought Christianity is religion. It's not a religion. Christianity the moment you see church. it as a religion, mm. that is where you have to dress a certain way to church. You have to dress, put on your tie, with a shoe, with a tie, you know, dress a certain way, walk a certain way, do a certain way. But isn't what the Bible says as well? It tells us mm-hmm. what it should and why, how we should dress. To where? Uh, I don't know, but I think okay. there's. If there's you don't know, way, don't quote the Bible. But I think there's some way I've read that women shouldn't wear pants. Isn't it? Is, women shouldn't wear men's clothing. Men's clear. Yeah. Do you know what uh, the, uh, the one who said this? I think it was in a Exodus or something. The one who wrote this book was Moses. Okay. Okay. That verse you are quoting is yeah. Moses. Yeah. Do you know the clothes Moses was wearing? I don't know. I I don't. Moses know was dressed. Moses was dressed like uh, let's say uh, um, an Arab. Okay. 
just uh, uh, I was stressed. just stressed straight. Okay? okay. And what was the ladies wearing that time? Which of the pastors in Africa dressed like Moses? So why are you quoting that Bible verse? Hmm. If you cannot dress like Moses, why are you telling this lady not to wear men's clothes? Dress like Moses. Hmm. Moses never put on tie. Moses was not wearing a suit. Hmm. Moses was not wearing a shoe. You understand? Moses was not putting on watches. Moses was not putting on perfumes, deodorant. <laughs> okay. So dress like Moses. <laughs> Then you can quote that Bible verse to a lady. Mm. If you cannot dress like Moses, stop quoting that Bible verse. Okay. You understand? I hear you. Because you must practice what you preach. If you say the Bible says that you must not wear ladies, ladies must not wear men's, men's clothes. clothes. Go and wear what Moses was wearing when he wrote that Bible verse. Okay. So it goes back that that's a religion. It's a religion. Okay. You understand? Yeah. So Christianity is not a religion. It's a lifestyle. Mm. People might get that. Once it becomes a religion, it controls you. So being a Christian, is it something that you have to have a feeling without being told that this is the right thing? Like you listen to your, to your uh, is it called conscious? Holy Spirit. You listen to your Holy Spirit. You listen to your conscious knowing that what you're doing is right and then you know that you're a Christian. Christianity as a Christian, you need the Holy Spirit. Case goes. That's what I can say. You understand? You will know when you have the Holy Spirit. You will know yourself. You will know. Okay. You understand? Mm. So Christianity is not a religion. It's a lifestyle. Uh, yeah. Once it becomes a religion, it controls you. That is why we have a lot of, excuse my Latin, stupid Christians mm. who always fight for pastors. Mm. They are under religion. They are not Christians. Because if you are a Christian, you will fight for who? Christ. Mm. <laughs> you understand? Mm. You will be fighting for who? Your master, Christ. But once you are fighting for your pastor. But now how will how will you fight for, for Christ where you just told me that? You are not Jesus, fighting like boom. I boom, understand, boom, but, okay? what yeah, but when what somebody makes a is, comment like Christ was Married to Mary Madeline. I understand, but what I'm trying to say is, I I, I heard you saying that Jesus was not was not his name. That's what I'm saying. But now, as I speak, everybody watching this podcast now mm. believe the name is Jesus Christ. Mm. It will take time for them to understand. Then why should you fight for something that you don't know for someone that you don't even so know their name? Then why do you have to go to heaven? You don't even know. <sighs> I like that one. <laughs> you understand? So my question is, Christianity is not a religion. It's a lifestyle. It's a lifestyle. Your lifestyle must even uh, give salvation to others. Your lifestyle must even be fruitful for others to plug. Your lifestyle must depict that of Christ. You understand? And being a Christian doesn't mean go and stand outside and be preaching. No. When you are selling food, you are preaching. Mm. When you are in the bank, you are preaching. When you are doing cleaning in somebody's house, you are preaching. When, when you are a nurse. When you are a nurse, you are preaching. When you are saving lives, you are preaching. Mm. When you are a teacher, you are preaching. So you don't necessarily have to say in words. You can even do it in actions. That's what I'm saying. I hear you. So what you are doing, let's say somebody comes to the bank to cash some money. Yes. You never called gangs to meet the guy outside mm. to take the money. Mm. You've done your crash job. Oh, I like that example. You understand? Yes. When you are selling food to you people didn't, didn't and you poison or anything. You, you did your Christ. This this is Christianity. It's not about standing outside and be pre- no. <laughs> I hear you. That was a great example ever. Hope you understand. Yes. Hello, Ebusiafo. So Pacifita Asura Child of Ford. And they're not for Mukodom is unique laser whitening. Unique laser whitening. I will toothpaste to strong one. What did you choose? And my will see a year fitter. Now, a year fitter, no, so no. Now, a ye and cow bonny beer, a woe no more beer. Any tea stain, coffee stain, smoking stain, see beer. Unique laser whitening product. A beginning in every swam or come, come, come. The other one is a wood to so. Now, would it be a goo or brush it or so? Now, dear, you choose in the swing in a come. 
wo wia and wo hu wenu mja no wo nu msa inti for a unique laser whitening i was 079 9979923330 unique laser whitening or say muni ses Penny for se be we are sent in da ni atopunu na ne paboni fonti e wo se mo bombo hu hia na ne papa mu die pro technologies and make am for mawo ane pro technologies we are specialized in both sales and installation of cctv cameras yet on as i install cctv cameras in the saw gun and as i broach it now if you are now pursue a cctv camera installation we need pro technologies and in saw so we get cctv camera installation electric fence automated gate access control video doorbell and our intercom and our satellite tv home theater so we pay back to and our to and our person be installing my pro technologies and our self fryer now sending so see if you didn't know from america but you may this and papa now pedia man you know none of you want to do that for me so you know the web which memo any a branch in organa you need more brow over it into sick of fire and some safe and yet you're part of organa what that da nani ya tenese ya saa general construction so we brochure na peso si fi o gana e da yi plan biya o peso si se wa shaa si dada anafe na peso si plan biya ya besi ya mao enwe chi so hiya solar power anabamba huwa nsense mdi adye wani ya ninsa wa suwa ni ya saa suya smart home apaifu mfidi ya biya o peso si she e wo fiye anawa chumbo mwa dema wo wani ya ninsa wa suwa we are just a call away ni ya saa suwa dena dema hain anafe brochure bedu gana na upe full house room ana apartment ha hain for short term and a long term ye be mo bia ne border form na bamba ho sam die man we ne ho en na ye ye interior decoration so wasi fie na wie ana ye so fie na mawo no ye sign decoration ye be sie sie wie ana office o e dia mawo en we ji so ton fi die bi na wo ho ko ya fa so install e ana ne settings ye be ye e dia mawo e wo gana wo be hu ye wo mere of front dental e di wadi a che dodo wa wo be hu ye e wo ashi ye ne emalin pharmacy e ne wo the same building for information or whatsapp 401 75 70 30 Zero and a plus four zero one six nine nine two two five four. Pro Technologies. We have the solutions for your security and home entertainment needs at affordable prices.